Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming back with some tips for painting with Infinity Painter. In this artwork, I use a shortman layer, clipping mask layer, and layer mask with some basic brushes. The link to download brushes is in the description of the videos. As usual, my first step is sketching out the idea. After sketching, I fill the background with soft errors and then add an adjustment layer above. Adjustment layers are allowed due to add non-destructive color adjustments and fewer two multiple layers at once. Long rest on the thumbnail to compare it with the Arnold's Fox. Note that not all filters are available as filter layers. Adjustment layer affects all layers below it. You can manipulate adjustment layer exactly like regular layers. Adjustment layers use the same functions that color adjustments and filter tools from the editing tools menu. Now, let's do this. I add a blur adjustment layer above to make the background more blurred. Add some lighting effects by using this way. Use lots of tool to fill the colors of the trees. Add a clippy mask layer above to add some highlights on the bodies of the trees. To make the tree feel farther and be affected by the atmosphere, I use a mask to attract the many moths of a layer. You can add a big map mask to a layer to mask out unwanted problems non-destructively. Layer mask is a 8-bit rescue image that can be edited like a regular layer. You can paint other masks, apply pillars, tonal sharpens, and any other tools. White area of the mask reveal the layer contents, and the black areas hide it. Tap on the layer thumbnail to open the option pop up. Tap on the mask icon to add a mask to current layer. You can add a match to a layer, to an adjustment filter layers, or to a group of layers. Only one mask can be added to each layer. The color panel turns red scale when a mask is active. You are editing the mask, but you don't see the mask itself. The dark colors on the mask add transparencies. Bright colors reveal the content of the content layers. Now, let's apply the technique with some blended masks of a layer.
thank for watching and don't forget to give me a like and subscribe my channel to follow my latest videos. Thank you.